Hello friends, in this video we are going to talk about how you can farm the layer 3 airdrop and few other airdrops on layer 3 with the new interface. So before we start the video, please don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button. It really helps my channel grow. Now before we move on to layer 3 and some other airdrops, I am doing my second giveaway on my Twitter page over here. So you can follow my Twitter page in order to uh, participate in some giveaways and also for airdrop and alpha feeds. Now most probably I will be doing an airdrop of NFT on the Aptos network in order to support the Aptos network and there would be more giveaways that would be coming in the future. Now let's go ahead and move into the layer 3 airdrop. Now layer 3 has a new interface. Uh, I just checked this in the morning and uh, it's uh, relatively much better than the older interface. I mean the older interface was also good but now this with this new interface it's a bit easier to go ahead and farm few airdrops over here. Now in order to farm the layer 3 airdrop uh, all you have to do is you will need to go ahead and collect some cubes over here. So as you can see I have already collected around 120 cubes. Now you will need some uh, funds in order to farm all these airdrops because uh, you have to like complete certain quests in order to be eligible for the cubes. Now as you can see uh, this is currently the season 1 of layer 3 airdrop and if I click over here as you can see my eligibility is confirmed and snapshot is in progress and I have minted like around 120 cubes and if you want to go ahead and farm airdrop on layer 3 you still have like 23 days uh, in order to go ahead and farm this airdrop. Now uh, you can go ahead and use my sign up referral link in the description for layer 3 airdrop farming as it really supports my channel. Now uh, what you can do is uh, you can go over here in search and you can search for this one this quest or uh, mission 200 because apart from the layer 3 airdrop itself uh, there is like 200,000 dollars worth of uh, rewards of for grabs on the layer 3. So all you can do is uh, you can go ahead and basically complete all of this task over here. So as you can see I have already completed this task. Now with this uh, 200,000 it's basically a pool so the more rank and the more quest you complete more uh, you would be eligible for a pie out of this 200,000. And apart from that uh, you also get these cubes by completing these missions over here which will indirectly help you qualify for the layer 3 airdrop. <coughs> now there are some uh, quest uh, that also gives you NFTs and uh, tokens so I just completed one. Uh, I forgot which one was it. Uh, so it gave me like around uh, 25 DGEN uh, tokens and also an NFT. So there are a lot of uh, quests that you can do in order to qualify for this layer 3 airdrop. And also if you go ahead and search in the open advanced search over here, you can basically filter this by token XP or reward. So if I go ahead and filter this by token, so yeah, I think it was this one, Mission OP Participation Prize. So I think it's only limited for 11,000 people as of now. So no, these are the number of players. I don't know. I think it's unlimited. So basically you, all you can do is you can go ahead and verify over here and claim the cube. So for this one, uh, they are airdropping like 0.09 optimism. So I haven't completed this one. Sorry, my bad. I think I completed this one. Some other uh, quest I had completed where I got uh, this uh, DGEN token as airdrop. And also you can basically go ahead and search for uh, NFTs over here. So there are some tasks where you can go ahead and uh, get some NFTs on layer 3. So most of the tasks are with Metis over here as you can see. And there are some layer 3 tasks as well directly. Now if we go to the main page over here, you can... Uh, once you uh, keep completing task, you get this rewards over here, which is gems and uh, you get some boost over here. Now this boost will help you get some additional XP and then they have some legendary chest over here and gems. With regards to gems, if you click over here, you can uh, visit the shop and purchase few items over here. So as you can see, uh, there is this 2x XP, 3x XP and then there is trade discount, bridge discount and good morning streak repair. So good morning streak repair is over here at the bottom right if you see. 
so every day you have to click on good morning so you you can maintain this streak and if by any chance if you miss it out for a day or so you can go ahead and uh, purchase this with uh, the gems that you have collected now apart from completing all this quest uh, most of the quest are on the layer 2 of ethereum so uh, it will help you get some air drops on the layer 2 as well so you might be eligible for maybe air drops in the future uh, like if base does a air drop then you might be eligible then there is zora then there is scroll then there is linea there are a lot of them where you can complete all these tasks so if we go over here in the ecosystem and check uh, these are different l2s and l1s over here that you can actually go ahead and complete the task over here if you want to uh, filter it out by the ecosystem so there are a lot of them now they have increased it earlier it was only like around 7 to 8 if i remember correctly with the whole interface and then as and when you level up there are some exclusive uh, level uh, tasks that you can go ahead and complete i mean quest so you can check this out over here and then there is collection of cubes and mission 200k which we already talk about and then if you want to do some quest on solana you can go ahead and do it so you, all you have to do is you will need to click on your profile over here and connect your solana wallet for uniswap you will need to go ahead and connect your uniswap wallet so there are a lot of things that you can do uh, but i'm not sure uh, what would be the airdrop value for it because I think the funding raise is anywhere between 2.5 million to I don't know 6 7 million I think so because I'm checking online it's showing like 2.5 million is raised but uh, I think uh, there are some additional seeding uh, investments round that have been done and layer 3 has received some more funding I think so and I think the valuation of layer 3 is much on the higher side I will need to go ahead and check. But still like if you want to go ahead and farm this uh, airdrop you can go ahead and farm this airdrop and also these are some of the rewards potential rewards that are earned by completing the quest over here now i've completed like around 205 quest uh, uh, which earned me like uh, 120 cubes and i've also completed some uh, quest which uh, gave me like uh, xp so that's why i keep on uh, leveling up on layer 3. so this is all for this video and in case if you have any doubts and questions, please feel free to leave a comment. I would be more than happy to help you. Hope you like my video. Thank you for watching.